Greetings, love posse. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to my channel. Welcome to today's conversation. Stay on your mission. We're all being bombarded by obstacles, trials, tribulations, but we must stay on our mission. We're surrounded by chaos, confusion, frustration. Many people are going through anxiety, severe anxiety. But we must stay on our mission. Continue to do your spiritual practices. If you pray, pray. If you read scripture, read scripture. Whatever it may be, yoga, EFT tapping, breath work. Get out in nature. Nature is a healing force. But you must stay on your mission, love posse. Because there are so many distractions in the external world out there the media, the government, Big Pharma, all the bobbing heads, what I call them, talking heads, grabbing at you, attempting to sway you, pull you, yank you from your path, from your mission, love posse but you have to have courage, you have to be strong. We are resilient because the Divine Mother created us that way. We all came through the portal into human existence through our Earth parents. And before we came here, there was a birth plan for our lives. We had a mission encoded on our DNA. If you remember your mission, then you understand the importance of staying the course. If you do not remember your mission, it's time. It's time that you sit down Meditate, do whatever you need to do to remember, rejoin, rejoin those of us that do, those of us that are creating the new earth, those of us who are on our path, doing our best to radiate love and compassion and understanding and kindness in the world. Love is the mission <laughs> because the forces out there are working diligently to divide us like they always have with these concepts, social constructs of race and gender and sexual orientation and religion and on and on and now facts versus the unvaxxed attempting to divide us. But love is our mission. Oneness is our mission. Peace, harmony, compassion is our mission. Truth, love posse is our mission. Don't get caught up in the fray, love posse. <laughs> Don't get caught up in the fray. Don't follow the unbelievers. Those who want to continue 
to make you a slave to this matrix, to their narrative of power and control and lies and deceit and scarcity and separation. It's all false, not posse. It's false. Each of us love posse. It requires all of us love posse to stay on our mission, to stay in the heart space, love posse, to stay connected to the divine, to each other, love posse, to all that is true and pure, to all that is love. No matter what's happening around you, no matter what you think people are doing to you, <laughs> love posse. <clears throat> what are you attracting to you? Remember the basics, love posse. Remember to take time out to connect, to be still, to go in the body, feel the sensations, to go out in nature, to open your heart, to listen, to smell, to walk upon the earth. Love Bob. Remember, stay on your mission. Stay on your mission, love posse. And that requires courage and strength and resilience. It requires doing things you may not be used to, love posse changing your patterns, your behaviors, eating the foods that support the body, be it being vegetarian or vegan, doing the best that you can do, living up to your potential. Remember that people we're all doing the best that we can do focus on your path focus on getting your shit together that helps all of us that helps the planet because we're interconnected love posse stay on your mission Love Posse, stay on your mission. Thank you for your time, Love Posse. I love you. The divine loves you. You are loved. Namaste.